Before coming to Iceland, I think you have to realize what Iceland means. It's the land of ice. It is cold. <laughs> So my name is uh, Jonas Stefansson, uh, my nickname is Jonni and uh, I'm 30 years old from uh, Iceland, uh, born in Reykjavik but I live in Akureyri in the north. GTA Travel has always been in my life because uh, the founder of the company is my great-grandfather. The uniqueness of GJ Travel is that it's such an old company. It's one of the first tour operators in Iceland. Uh, so it has a, a long history. It's still a family run business. So I started guiding uh, about six years ago. First as a hiking guide and mountain biking, but uh, now as a driver guide. As far as my guiding, I've always tried to let people feel like they're doing it as much on their own as they can. Like, I don't, I don't like to be the guy that brings everybody out at every stop and tries to lecture them there. I try to rather tell people about the places during the drive and then let people experience on their own. Maybe I've been lucky in my career. I've never had any tough groups or, or uh, yeah. So it's it's at least for for my six years as a tour guide, it's it's always been fun and pretty easy. Uh, I think the most common mistake for for people traveling to Iceland is that they don't bring the right gear or or, or right clothing. That I mean by that. So a lot of people travel here and. They're actually like just on sneakers and jeans and and once again, like I said, it is called Iceland for a reason. Seems like most people uh, visit the south coast, which of course has a lot of beautiful places to to visit. But I think uh, I think people that do get out uh, around the rest of the country, they will be pretty amazed what uh, else Iceland has to offer, but as far as one thing that you can't miss in Iceland, I, th I think it's impossible to answer. <laughs> Iceland has a lot of unique food definitely to try out, but I would say tasting the lamb meat would be something that you don't want to miss. And then of course the, uh, the seafood that we can offer is, is really fresh and good. So. Icelandic fish and then the Icelandic lamb, I would say, would be a must-have. Thank you, uh, Icelandic, you would say tak. And, yeah, I don't know, good day or something like that. Good <laughs> day in Icelandic. <laughs>